At the end of 1984, most Reverend Professor Ida Hauser received a letter from Reverend Wynne Lewis of Kensington Temple in London inviting him to come over to Britain to minister to them. The high-powered delegation of Pentecostal leaders welcomed him at the Heathrow Airport and drove him to a first-class hotel in central London. At this stage, the crusade spanned through London, Elling, Handros, Cockfield, Balcombe, Brighton, Hove, Crawley, several other towns. resurrection is a day that the church yesterday's maximum becomes her today's minimum resurrection transformed the church is that impossible with God it's not it's not beginning today the voice of God should be louder than any other voice in England. <laughs> Turn with me to the Bible. <laughs> Acts chapter 4. The power to the church. The Christian manifesto. Christian Manifesto. Acts chapter 4, beginning from verse 21. So when they had further threatened them, they let them go, finding nothing how they might punish them because of the people. For all men glorified God for that which was done. For the man who was above 40 years, ab above 40 years old, on whom this miracle of healing was showed. The Pharisees and Sadducees feared the church. Every believer in this country and the countries of the world to combine their faith together until the government feared the church. We shall not bow to the God of dead religion. We shall submit to the Prince of Peace. The Lord Jesus is his name. the fear in those days the church with one voice began to manifest power in the name of the risen Christ they went everywhere verse 23 said and being let go they went to their own company and reported all that the chief priests and elders had said unto them. And when they, were, when they heard that, they lifted up their voice to God with one accord and said, Lord, thou art God. Everybody say that. Lord, thou art God. I'd like to pray for that woman with rubber band in her neck before we pray this prayer for the England people. Come here, ma. Yes, ma. I want God to give you your miracle first. Archbishop Benson Idahosa ministered on the mighty anointing. And the lame in By the midst. gift of the word of knowledge, he invited a sick woman in the crowd to step out for healing. For months, her neck had been in a band, but as the servant of God prayed, she was instantly healed. The neck band was removed. Glory to God. with loud voice, and the healing virtue of Christ touched your neck. In the name of Jesus of Nazareth, you foul destructiveness trouble. In the name of Jesus to be healed. 
now be loose. You are set free. You are set free. You are set free. You are set free. In the name of Jesus of Nazareth, neck you are healed. I command it. I believe it. <laughs> oh, Boria Mama. Marandolo Momo Se Paraba. Yeah, take it right now. It's yours. It is done. In Jesus' name. Lose and be healed. In the name of Jesus. Rise up, you are healed. Your neck is healed. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Rise up and be healed in Jesus' name. Remove your rubber band. The Lord has made you whole. I see the healing power of God. Throw it away. Your neck is back to yourself. In Jesus' name. Go in peace. Go. Run back to your seat. Go back to your seat. You are healed in the name of Jesus. The sick and afflicted flocked into the Royal Albert Hall in droves. Jesus Christ of Nazareth showed himself alive by many infallible proofs. In the, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, she's healed. She's healed. In Jesus' name, let every sick here, let every bound, let every afflicted, in the name of Jesus of Nazareth, Lord, descend your power now, 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 now. Get up in the name of Jesus. Come this Indian man had been in a wheelchair right now, for seven here. agonizing in years. Jesus name, he exercised his faith as the prayer of come healing out. swept the vast come arena. Out. He wobbled out of his wheelchair come all by himself. What joy! In the name of he Jesus. walked home without Get his up. wheelchair. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, walk right now. 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 Walk now. Now. Walk. In the name of Jesus. Walk. 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 Walk there. Walk there. See. Rise and walk. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, be healed. Deaf ears open. Don't tongue be loose. In the name of Jesus of Nazareth, be healed in the name of Jesus. You are set free. Take your healing there. Take your healing. In the name of Jesus of Nazareth, be set free. Be healed right now. In Jesus' name. This young woman had never known come what here. walking is. In the name of Jesus Her feet of crossed what? and stiff. Come on, come on. She walk, marched walk in style more. to the platform. Right now. God is a healer Jesus. indeed. This way. This way. This way. Begin to walk better and better and better and better. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lamb of God. Glory to God. Glory to God. There's the Lord that he let thee. He bore thy grief. He carried away your sorrow. He was wounded for your transgression. The chastisement for our peace. We laid on him. And by his stripes, you have been healed. Hallelujah. Let him begin to learn to walk with him again. Hallelujah. If you know the Lord has touched your body, come and tell us what God has done quickly. I want just a few testimonies. All who have been healed in the name of Jesus. Be loose. Be loose right now. Another Indian man in Jesus, came with a stop. torment in his life. For Quiet. ten years, he had been possessed with a spirit of, of epilepsy. He came to the platform, the middle, and the power right of God seized him, and he fell down loose. under the Spirit of God, and was totally delivered. Be loose! Be loose! Out of him! Out of him now! Ouch! 
in Jesus' name. You tell us about him. This man had uh, epilepsy attack since a long time, near about 10 years. And praise God that he's released now and God had freed him from that epilepsy attack. And you have seen that his, he had been in the position of getting and God healed him. Hallelujah. Where is he from? He's from India. He's from India. He is here. Sister, rise up. You are free. You are free. Jump up, you are free. Get up, you are free. There is healing everywhere. Amen. The power of God is moving everywhere. Amen. And your neck, right now, in Jesus' name of Nazareth, you called, be loose. In Jesus' name, be free. Completely. You are set free. And now heal. Who brought this child? Come on, sir. What has happened to your son? Come and tell us. You are a steward in this meeting. Tell us what happened to your son. He has been having double vision. He's been operated twice. Operated twice. He still had double vision. Yeah. He's just been prayed for, and now he says he has got single vision. I Thank you, Lord. Glory be to God. Thank you, Lamb of God. He shall not come back again. He is healed in the name of Jesus of Nazareth. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Another testimony. For the first time in how many years? In two years. She's been walking up and down here. For two years, Come on up this woman had been living in a wheelchair. She came to the Royal Albert Hall late, so she was placed behind the platform. But God's right, power to heal was everywhere in the, the sanctuary. Up. Make room. Are you her husband? Has she done in the wheelchair? Yes. Keep walking, love. Don't trip over the cable. Walk to Mr. Walker. Gradually, she abandoned her wheelchair, climbed the platform to testify what mighty things God had done. It was a glorious sight as she danced with her excited husband. This is the day that the Lord has 